Hello everyone. Today I'm going to teach you how to draw isometric circle. So like you'll be using this as square. So remember you are going to have t square here, so you'll be using this as square. So the angle is 30 degrees here. Even if I continue like this, the angle is 30 degrees. And then the angle this side is 60 degrees. So you start by uh, drawing a line this side, 30 degrees this side and also this side it decrease this side then you draw the vertical line here after you'll measure from here to here just for practice from here to here you'll measure 100 from here to here 100 from here to here 100 again it decrease this side again it decrease this side from this point you take the your vertical line until here also from this side, the vertical line until here. So this one will meet somewhere there. Also from this point, it decreases to draw the line there. Also from this point, it decreases to draw the line this side. So you are going to use it decrease a lot here. This decrease, this decrease, this decrease. This side is one, two, three. Then the vertical line remains vertical. Then from here to here, remember it was 100. From here to 100. From here to 100. So now you must get the center. I'm going to measure from here to here 50. From here to here 50. Also from here to here 50. Then center line. Going vertical up. Center line. Vertical up. When you get to this point, it decrease this side. This side. It decrease this side. Until this point. Also from this point, vertical line. Center line. When you get to this point, it decrease until this line okay now i'm left with this one here this point it decrease this side also from this side it decrease from this side so now we're having uh, three planes this side this view this one and this one let's start with this one you'll take your ruler you'll join this point and this point using a ruler so you just join using a ruler you just join this point and this point also this point and this point also join this point and this point after you join this point and this point you join also this point and this point you join then after you take your compass take your compass uh, you take your compass and put it here so you'll take a compass like this, then you'll put your compass from this point to this point, from here to here, then you draw the arc, so the arc is going to look like this. Also from this point, from here to here, you draw the arc. So you put your compass from this point until this point here, then you draw the arc. Also from this side, from this point until this point, you draw an arc. After you put your compass from this point up to here, like this. Then you draw arc, so it's gonna look like something like this. Also, from this point, you put it here to here. Then you draw. So now you like this. So it look like an ellipse, but it's not an ellipse. It's an isometric circle, so it's not an ellipse. Right, let us come to this side. Now you join this point and this point. Okay, from this side, you join this point and this point. Right again, you join this point and this point using a ruler. Also, this point and this point using a ruler. Then you put your compass day to day. Then you draw the arc. You put your compass from day to day. You draw an arc. Put your compass from day to day. You draw an arc. Also, from day to day, you draw an arc. Okay, on top here, you join this one and this one. Okay, also this one and this one. After you join this point and this point, also this corner and this corner. After again, you put the compass from here to here, draw an arc. Put the compass from here to here, draw an arc. Also from here to there, draw an arc. From there to there, draw an arc. So this is the isometric box. So you can just start by measuring 100, 100, and in practice until you get it right. Thanks for watching.